involving more and more community members. Even we never met them. Even they live on the other side of the world. I just personally found it fascinating. It is. It is fascinating. I mean, if you think about it, my group, uh, like the partnership and let's say also marketing, you have yeah. people from Hong Kong, you have people from Australia, from Argentina, Brazil. Right. Me from Italy, you know, so we're yes. really uh, like uh, international yes. and yes. everyone can participate. Anyone can get involved and uh, contribute to the, you know, to, for the success of the, of the DAO. Absolutely. You know? Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the Future Hour. Today, we're super happy and excited to have Andrea from Ballister Dow to be here. Thank you so much, Andrea. Yeah, it's my pleasure, my pleasure. Absolutely, absolutely. Yeah. So earlier, we had some chat. The so first question, could you tell us how did you get here, right, from a pilot who lived in China for years and now being the head of the partnership at Ballister Dow? It's just an incredible journey. Uh, yeah, it's been, it's been quite in interesting. Uh, so I've been a pilot for 20 years. I've oh, been an wow. airline pilot for a very long time and wow. I've been operating uh, pretty much all over the world, especially in Europe. But right. uh, the last part of my career was yeah. in China. Wow. And I was based in Shanghai yeah. uh, for, for five years. Right. Uh, but then, you know, we, we had uh, COVID, you know, yeah. COVID started. Right. And I, I mean, I've been in crypto for a very long time, yeah. you know, and uh, so, um, you know, it was like a natural evolution. It basically coincided, you know, the, cr the COVID crisis coincided as well with the explosion of DeFi. Yeah. So um, during that period, I remember very well that, you know, the uh, aviation industry was pretty much almost dead yeah. because, yeah. yeah, completely. No travel. Uh, no travel, travel, everything yeah. grounded. So I, um, by pure luck, I would say I started to get involved with DeFi. And, uh, you know, we we're talking about DeFi summer back right. in, in summer 2020 when uh, I started to interact with all the DeFi ecosystem and stuff, you know. So, and Balancer was one of those projects that uh, was just launching back in the days. And I, uh, you know, I started to interact with it and I started to participate uh, into the community. There was like a, you know, Discord channel where, you know, you of course you yeah. spend your time there. And, um, and then little by little, I got more and more involved with the community. Yeah. And uh, until I became, you know, let's say what we call ballers. Ballers yeah. are basically like some sort of representative of, of the community. Okay, nice. So that's how the transition went from being a full time okay. pilot to, yeah. to this, this position now. So from, yeah. from, from that point, I started to um, get more and more involved until, uh, you know, uh, balancing became my full time, okay. full -time job. Right okay. So, yeah. Awesome, awesome. Um, would you tell us a little bit what is it like to be part of uh, working within the DAO? The DAO, I mean, the organization itself is something that uh, is, is very fluid. First of all, it's very fluid and nice. uh, it's, it's, it's still like an, at very early stages. Right. Working with uh, for a DAO and in a DAO uh, yeah. is not the, s the, the most simple, you know, the simplest thing on earth because sometimes right. there are, um, you know, because you know, hierarch the hierarchical structure right. is not as strong as, you know, I would say, uh, traditional traditional, yeah. traditional uh, companies. Yeah. So it's a little bit more complicated to interact with others. But at the same time, uh, we believe that uh, the, the decentralization process goes through, you know, also this destructuring, you know, organizations. Yes. So, um, so yeah, so I think I think that's the future in a, in, a, in a way, you know. Absolutely, the, yeah, absolutely. So. Yeah, I, and I really believe that's such an important part, right? Because we have all just come together and have a same goal and we involve in more and more community members. Even we never met them, even they live on the other side of the world. I just personally found it fascinating. It is, it is fascinating. I mean, if you think about it, my group, uh, like the partnership and let's say also marketing, you have yeah. people from Hong Kong, you have people from Australia, from Argentina, Brazil, right. me from Italy, you know, so we're yes. really uh, like uh, international. Yes. And yes. everyone can participate, anyone can get involved and uh, contribute to the, you know, to, for the success of the, of the DAO. Absolutely, you know? absolutely so. awesome. So could you tell us what are something that is super exciting to you that you guys are working at the moment? In terms of projects, we, there are many things that we're doing, of course. Right. Cer certain things probably cannot be disclosed at this, st at this stage, but we are working on, on a number of, uh, let's say, uh, ideas. You know, one is uh, we are trying to connect with 
a number of uh, other projects that use the balancer technology. Yeah. So, uh, and uh, we also work a lot with on, on expanding, you know, on s you know, basically sending the, uh, the balancer technology on other chains. So yeah. we work with independent teams that also want to build, you know, maybe DEXs uh, using the balancer technology yeah. with different brands and stuff. So yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, that's, there are a lot of things that we're doing, uh, nice. but yeah, I would say that, you know, we tend to, we want to expand more the balancer, um, uh, network, you yeah. know, and ecosystem. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah. Absolutely, that's super exciting, right? Because uh, coming to events here in Milan, this is my first crypto event in Italy, and I really feel the energy of you uh, and Maria and everybody coming together, sharing their knowledge, sharing their vision, what they're working on, and the community is just so sharing and caring, almost like a big family. For me, that's super exciting. It, it is, it is, in fact, uh, the uh, this is the first event we do in Milan, you yeah. know, the, the Spaghetti is 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 the first one and i'm glad that you guys met uh, maria yeah. and yeah. Uh, uh you know definitely still it's still early stages for for the community i right. i can you know there's so much potential yeah and absolutely. uh and yeah, so excited to be here. Yeah. Awesome. Yeah. Absolutely. Actually fun fact that maria was actually the first person i did a podcast with ever on this channel. Really? Yeah, if we go back to the audience out there, go back to uh, all the way down, like the first podcast ever was actually with Maria. Oh, really? Now, one and a half year later, we actually first time ever met in person. Oh, really? So okay, very cool. No, she's part of, uh, of the Balancer DAO. Right? She's, uh, she's she's a great girl and we work a lot together. Yeah. We're like best yeah, buddies, yeah, you know? Yeah. And she works so hard. Yeah, right? yeah, yeah, she does, she does. Yeah, she every, does. Time, every time I, co I, I get a chance to talk with her, she's like, oh, Jazz, yeah, I'm like more busy, now I'm working on this, this and that. And, and then, but also, yeah, at the same time, she always make time for me to give me advice to share what are some updates uh, she's so super she's super cool yeah I definitely appreciate people like uh, you guys in the industry just because people like us more and more so working together is gonna bring more open-mindedness more collaboration into a community and that's Absolutely. the foundation of everything right i so totally agree i totally yeah. i mean and, and this and, and this event is where you know where these communities are actually formed too and where Absolutely. you manage to you know to connect with others and you yeah. know share ideas and, yeah. and so on so. absolutely so with that said i know that already we chatted about exchange a few sentences in chinese for oh. all the audience out there um what the chong wen shoda fei chang bu hao uh what you ni ni hui ni hui shuo dan shi bu tai kuai bu tai kuai okay okay what what chuan what Okay, so okay, okay. Ni ni tinda lo ma? Tinda lo. Okay, very good. Tinda lo, tinda lo. Shanghai, I really like Shanghai. Oh, well, very much like, very much like Shanghai. Yes, Shanghai. Yes. 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 For me, Spanish is the same. Ah, Sivan, Sivan Yayu, Sivan Yayu, yeah, yeah. Um, but but Sivan Yayu, if you say in you, it gives you, uh, not uh, difficult. Uh, not 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 well, Andrea, last thing. That, that's awesome. Uh, call to action, do you want people to follow you on Twitter or on LinkedIn, something like that? Of course, you can follow me uh, on Twitter at Chanfru, C I A N F R U. Okay, nice. that's pretty complicated. Yeah. And that's the best way you can find me. Okay, every day. okay. okay. awesome. So, well, guys, follow him uh, on uh, Twitter and uh, thank you so much for watching and for the Chinese audience out there. <laughs> bye bye. <laughs> bye bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. Awesome. Yeah, thanks, man. <laughs> thanks, man. Thank that's you. Awesome. Appreciate that's awesome. so cool. Yeah. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to another episode of the Future Hour. Today, we're so happy and excited to have Andrea from Balancer Labs. Balancer Dow. Balancer Dow. Ladies and gentlemen. <laughs>